Well, an experimental new vehicle is emerging as the Pentagon's top choice for a new long-range rapid attack weapon. This is all according to Alan Schaffer, De Deputy Assistant Defense Secretary for Research and Engineering. Speaking at a defense industry conference, Schaffer said that testing hypersonic arms was a top priority effort by Pentagon weapon developers. Hypersonic vehicles have the ability to deliver nuclear or conventional payloads in precision strikes within hard to penetrate air spaces, just as in countries like China, Russia, and Iran. Schaffer said that the U.S. did not want to be the second country to understand how to develop the weaponry. He was referring to China's surprise test that took place just two months ago, in which a new hypersonic glide vehicle called Wu 14 was revealed. In testing, the Pentagon's hypersonic weapon flew a very long distance at very high speeds. But Schaffer says the next step is for weapons engineers to find a way to make the system more affordable.